This foil oil makes Breed male Jack Russell was brought in with many rashes on its body. The owner is very concerned, so he brought it here to Topayo Vets for treatment. Preliminary blood tests also show that everything is normal. What could be wrong? This is a Be Kind to Pets veterinary educational video sponsored by Topayo Vets. 11 of September 2018. This is a four years old male neutered Beagle Cross Chuck Russell. So, the, what, what's the complaint on the rashes? And the rashes, but then uh, I have to see only if it's born inside the stomach. Okay, so the two, two, two complaints, the rashes, which part of the body the rashes in? The blood side here. Okay. So and also the leg the whole, Yeah, hang on first. The height, the height. So the the main complaint is the back side. The is uh, itchy, the rashes. Yeah, itchy rashes. Right? So and also here in the body. So dog licks, yeah. uh, licks, and then the, the stomach. Uh, then the hair becomes thinner. Yeah. thinner. <laughs> now this one is very interesting. You can see uh, there. This part is uh, bald, less less hair. Uh. Yeah. It's due to licking. Uh, normally the dog bites and licks. Because we bite. Yeah. Uh, and then stay, 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 Bite the tail. Yeah, bite the tail. You want to bite the tail? Uh, and chase, chase, chase. Chasing the tail. the tail up. Chasing the tail up. Yeah. So these are the signs of the inner set going around in circles. Mm. Uh, so this is a classical sign of the inner set. And the... Uh, hey. And uh, sometimes they, they, they drop. They manage to uh, re release the oil. Mm. Sometimes they can't. Do you think a mother? Huh? A mother? Do you think a mother? A mother. Focus. 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 So normally what we do is we take a muzzle, muzzle the dog and then I will expose the inner sac. Mm. Now sometimes when they bite, it becomes very uh, much infected. These are all rashes due to infection, skin pain. Here, focus on here. Wait, how do you zoom? Okay. Yeah, correct. So <coughs> now I'm going to express the inner sac. And, but to do that, I have to muzzle first. Hold first, huh? Hold first. Don't bite me. Stay. They bite people. Uh. Yeah. It, so it, we cannot it. muzzle, right? Give to, the, give to her and two. Yeah. Yes. Cannot, cannot muzzle. Okay. Okay, okay, cannot muzzle. Okay, we cannot muzzle here. Yeah. Actually, just, just, just focus. Stay, stay, stay. stay. Because you don't just do two yeah. one one way only. Yeah. Rookie, no, no don't bite. Can I bite, okay? Mm. You see your chop already. See your chop already. You have a big muzzle, you don't have a big muzzle. Okay. If it's on the floor it's harder to do actually. Yeah. Because the dog is, is the dog is dominant on the floor, actually on on the chair, on the table. Don't bite, don't bite, don't bite. Mm. You can don't see bite, good, huh? don't bite, behave. Quickly behave. tie behind, tie, tie very tight, tightly, uh, tightly, very tight. Good boy. Very tight, huh? not, yes. not a little bit, uh, just very tight, very, very tight. But it seems to be quite okay on the floor. And faster than that, see, it takes too long by the time the dog is smart enough. Okay, and then... Behave, behave, okay. Judy should go and help out instead of letting the owner do tying. Uh, Okay, up here. Yeah? Okay, yeah, come, do you come take over? Okay, okay, okay. So, so there's one of the reasons, yeah, the second reason okay. that I've checked is the ears. Like the ear, any ear trouble? No, sometimes it's like the ear, rushing sometimes. Uh, sometimes they use the leg to scratch the ears. Scratch the ears. Then the mouth will scratch here. Uh, this is the ear inflammation. Uh, you can see the ear is... It's definitely reddish. The ear, ear is reddish. Normally the ear should be should be white or pink color. So it definitely has ear inflammation. Any, any discharge coming out? Mm, no doubt. Huh? Because I always clean the air. Ah, so she put something in and then the dog doesn't like it. Then let's see the other ear. Huh? 
Muslim so you hold it up. So there, 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 there is a reason. Uh, so here is the chi. Uh. So, uh, so the doctor is not stretching the body. Mm. So on this side, like uh, stretching side. So, so in the end, the owner discovered the dog has rashes all over the body because this leg will be stretch like this. It come out like this. Yeah, like that. Uh, so yeah, yeah. can tell. Maybe the ear, ear infection, ear pain, uh, itchiness, some go to the neck. Oh, so, so this side and that side. So this dog has two problems: the ear infection and the inner sac. Inner sac. I will try and express it. And it may, it may not be there because the dog has successfully uh, put it on the floor. Okay. But these are the signs of biting here. Okay, hold the hold the shoulder, shoulder, shoulder. Okay. When you're shaved, just shave. Uh, uh, two shave. days ago, dog. Who the, the groomer, right? Yeah, the groomer. So, actually. I won't I won't I won't express it. It's uh, very nervous. The groomer did it. Huh? Did the groomer do it? Press it. I press it but the never, groomer? never come up. The groomer the did groomer, it. The groomer I don't know. Well bring up again. Let me just check. I, I won't press it, I just check. It seems to be empty already. <laughs> really? Okay, relax. Stay. Yeah, they are very worried okay. because it's quite pain. Okay, okay. Well I can feel that. They still there. It's still yeah. swollen. Okay. It's still swollen. They still oil there. Oh, it's still there. But no, normally, uh, okay, okay, this dog is too nervous. I, I will, I will uh, not, not, not do it anymore. But uh, okay. the best is to give a bit of sedation. Okay. Uh, okay. I will sleep, sleep a while, a bit. Uh, mm. Then I can do it. Okay. Then, then we shape the spin. So that you can watch all the, all the, all the, all the, the dog is placed under sedation. Okay, okay, let me, I'm going to injection now. Okay, hold. Then the vein is here. Okay, the mm -hmm. vein, huh? So, 45 degrees is better. So the growth, yeah. But this is uh, about eighty five percent of its weight. Okay, I'll take a photo because I need you to do this case uh, and press here to stop the bleeding. The dog's anal glands were then exposed. See the oil coming out already. Eh? Come inside, you do come inside. You see the oil coming out already, even before I touch it. Eh? <coughs> Are you all dripping already? You see a lot of oil? Yeah. Ah, that's why the Blood samples were also collected for screening. Next, the dog is shaved so medication can reach the skin better. The dog is waking up from sedation, so an e collar is placed for safety in case he bites. Hair samples are also taken for a fungal culture to test for fungal infection. Okay, so this one is fungal culture tray. It's really the hair sample.
say. Then they build the tree. Then after two weeks, rest of will come. Gas anesthesia is used as the dog is almost awake. This is how the dog looks like after shaving. We shave the dog and you can see the body is full of rashes which the owner has complained about. And uh, some of them look like ringworm. It's generalized. Uh, generalized. Okay, turn over. Now we flush the ears, irrigate the ears. And uh, that's under gas because it's a very nervous dog. As you can see, this side also, the rashes are there. This one is it. Some really look like ringworm. And uh, I will use the ultraviolet light. We, we also do the in trade culture for ringworm. So this scratching is really bad. Now one of the causes could be allergies or so. Now this one really looks like a ringworm. They are little rings. Nothing in the ears, right? Nothing. It's just the ear irrigation. Under gas, yeah. Okay, let's finish. finish. Okay, it takes about one hour. You press the express already. Yeah, express already. Yeah. We just uh, give a, a bit of the. Let me just do the ultra I, I, I do again. Can anything? Don't have. Okay. Now just uh, okay. You, you, you just do. I just just hold hold and then we do it. Do you see any fluorescent or not? Very fast one, huh? Just about here, okay, maybe. There is, uh, but not, not obvious. Uh. Not very obvious. Maybe the owner used shampoo, uh, okay. And you stop and stop, yep. So we let the dog get up and then... Uh, of course, not all, not all circular lesions are due to ringworm. The dog is then bathed with antifungal shampoo. Yeah. After a while, the dog recovers from anesthesia and is ready to go home. He is sent home with the following prescriptions. Antifungal and antibiotic tablets. Anti mite wash, fungal shampoo, and a special prescription diet for skin and food sensitiveness. The fungal culture and blood samples are also sent to the lab for screening.